I knew this day would come <laughs> where I would literally when last Christmas is out and basically buy the biggest last Christmas gift you can get and here is the haul <laughs> this is really weird filming like this because this is like the first time I've done an angle like this but Got some festive jumper on when last Christmas. Absolute freaking classic. Got joggers on, I'm all comfy and ready to film today. And let me go in closer. So, yeah, happy Christmas! Happy Lush Christmas launch week. And it's been a whirlwind of a year. But finally, the best time of year has arrived and I have the world's biggest Lush Christmas box 2020 right in front of me and it smells so good already and you get 32 products in this which is practically the whole range. Bath, shower, body, you name it, it is in here. And rightly so, it's called the Wow Box because wow, there's a lot of things in here. So we're gonna literally unbox it together. If you're wondering what I'm gonna use this box for afterwards, it is going to be either for future Christmas decorations or my new Halloween decorations. So we're probably going to be here a while so I suggest if you want to carry watching to see what is in the wow box which is worth 195 pounds then grab a beverage of choice maybe a pumpkin spice latte settle down I literally keep on watching because my fingers are itching to open this I'm going to use a slid as a tray to keep things in. This is the menu, I'm gonna go by this and let you know what is inside some ingredients. Obviously, as you can see, there's some returning favorites. This feels like lucky dip. I'm so freaking excited. Okay. I was so excited for this day to come because last Christmas is literally my favorite collection. And the first product, mm, very fruity, is TikTok robot. So he is basically smelling of orange squash off the top of my head. That is also Neroli and Popping Candy. People at work think he looks like an astronaut. You know who you are if you're watching this. And this is going to go a very bright orange and absolutely love him. Next section. Let's go. Okay guys, this is my new favourite style of this one. If you've been a Lushy for years, you will know this one. It is Butter Bear! So freaking cute and he's been remoulded. Like, probably this is probably the best version of him. He looks so like, kind of like full of personality and kind of like animated and classic vanilla scent with chunks of cocoa butter in. If you don't like butter bear, who even are you? So, oh, I absolutely love that one. Right, next section. Okay, this one I was pretty excited to use because I love a shampoo bar, I love Snow Fairy, and we have Snow Fairy Shampoo Bar, which indeed, smells like snow fairy so freaking good and in this you have persian lime oil a marshmallow root powder and obviously synthetic musk for the scent of snow fairy so marshmallow root is very kind of like i want to say nourishing helps to make the hair feel really sleek as well and I feel like hopefully it'll be similar to angel hair which I've got already and it's very nearly finished 
And you've got like a little nice cute star. The shampoo bars are supposed to last about 40 washes or 40 to 60 washes depending on how often you wash your hair and use it. So very excited. It's a brand new for this year as well. Okay, this is a very, very cute soap. It is very similar in kind of character to Butter Burr, but it's a polar bear soap. Interesting, kind of minty. Is it supposed to be minty? Got coconut milk powder, coconut water, cocoa butter, Brazilian orange oil. So there's a lot of coconut and butters in here. So he's going to be very hydrating. And my camera can't focus properly today. But here he is. He looks so freaking cute. And he actually stands up which is adorable. The next one, okay, I absolutely love this last year when it came out. And it is a bubble bar. Oh, so Maybe the scent of this has gone on to this. But it does smell like after eight. But this is as minty as you could freaking get because it is polar bear plunge. Bubble bar. He is beautifully cooling in the bath and he's so freaking cute. So in him we have literally spearmint oil and cream of tartar. Very basic ingredients and loads of loads of bubbles and he's just so freaking cute. I love him. I'm so glad they brought him back because I think I had like two last year. I want to say and like especially if you're ill with a flu or cold it also helps to clear your sinuses okay the next one is another returning favorite absolutely love him he's deeper and brighter in color which I love and it is snowman dreaming so gorgeous so when you put him in the water all the colors come out at the side and you just get this beautiful, beautiful kind of like swell in the water. And I think I literally had like two last year because I love it so freaking much. So it's lavender, cornstarch, cedarwood. And yeah, it's just really nice and relaxing. I feel like he would go quite well with polar bear plunge as like a bath cocktail which I'm excited about. I'm trying to keep them quite separate because I don't want the custom mix because I have a lush Instagram, if you guys didn't know, or if you've come from that. And I like to post everything on there. So, oh my God. Anyway, before we get into this, is a lush yay, which is pretty straightforward. I'll link it in the description box below if you want to follow me. Um, Snow Fairy Bubble Roll. It looks like comforter, but glittery, bubblegum pink. What do you not love about Snow Fairy? Oh my god, that is so nice and sweet. I mean, I'm so basic. I'm literally all over Snow Fairy. Anything Snow Fairy, I'm like, give it to me now. Right, we have a soap, another soap, and it is good old classic shooting stars. Oh, it's so good. So this one is Cillian lemon oil, starfruit extract, bergamot oil, and coconut oil, and lime oil. So it's very kind of sweet and citrusy, like honestly, what is Lush Christmas if they don't bring this out? I absolutely love it. And you got glittery star as well. And yeah, can't wait to use this over Christmas. Especially now we have to wash our hands more. I think the last section is two more soaps. And we got two absolute Lush Christmas classics. Right, this one does have lemon myrtle oil. There's also grapefruit and lang lang and gardenia extract. And it is baked Alaska, which is now sold in slices. Oh, it is just iconic. 
I absolutely love it and you've got like kind of what looks like snow on the top as well and the last one on this level of goodies is snow cake I love snow cake so much it is literally apart from snow fairy my favorite Christmas scent ever oh, just smells like marzipan it is so good I love this year's version as well it looks like dripping like icing so it looks like you can kind of see it it looks like it's dropping down and it's a pretty pretty turquoisey color with what looks like it's supposed to be a mountain inside i don't know i'm just guessing but oh, I this might be the first soap i will use i'm actually obsessed with this right that is the first row done guys yeah just right into the second row i already see a classic this is actual classic bath bomb is luxury luxury lush pud oh, so good i think this one if i can smell right still smells like comforter so you've got black currant absolute cypress oil and bergamot oil and all the little color discs float out and make this really pretty multicolored bath art and you got a little kind of like holly on the top as well and it goes super pink it's just what can you not love about this I feel so festive just looking at what I've got so far and okay okay guys this is my favorite can you hear that can you hear that it is jingle bells and it's supposed to smell like milky bath bubble bath but to me it smells exactly like baby powder oh my freaking gosh and it looks more defined in like style design this <laughs> year. So here is a close up. Look at the ribbon. Like it looks like a really cute Christmas bauble. And the design on the bottom as well. <sighs> Do you know what? I'm gonna probably have to buy some more of these. And I know I get discount at Lush, but it's still quite a lot of money. So I'm gonna have to wait till next payday to buy some more but I know that's probably going to be one of the first things I'll be using because <laughs> I love it so much and I can't remember if I just said it is smaller this year so that's a bit sad but so happy it has returned I have a brand new bath bomb called Angel's Delight which is tangerine and orange oil and to me it smells kind of like that makeup you get in kids magazines and it's weirdly comforting and you got a little kind of like a moon so this is the design here it's a little moon glittery pink and definitely quite citrusy love it okay another classic if you don't like this who even are you is Golden Wonder. Yep, jingling around again. Hopefully there's some mini bath ones in there. It's supposed to smell like champagne. And you've got orange oil, lime oil, and cognac oil. And it is really, really stunning in the water. It makes your water go kind of like a green color. It's just very, very nice and refreshing. And I just love it. Love a bit of Golden Wonder. And it's already all over my finger. Where am I gonna put this? Ooh. Right, we have a Wow Box exclusive. So in this box, you get two exclusives you can actually can't buy separately. And I've just found the first one, which is Validation Shower Bomb, which is literally like a bath bomb but using the shower and you literally hold it under water 
foams up, pop it over skin and rinse away and it's so good. This one is Myr Retinoid Brazilian Orange Oil and Vanilla Absolute. Hmm, very, very nice. Have a good close up. Very Christmassy, really nice gold glittery star. That's gonna be nice to use after a workout as well. Love that. And we have another shower bomb. This one you can buy separately, but it's covered in gold from the other one. But it is Sugar Plum Shower Bomb, which you got aniseed, that is red mandarin oil, plum juice, and Osmalthus Absolute. And this is supposed to look like a bit of a plum. You've got like a leaf detailing there as well. And it's just a really nice fruity scent. I can definitely smell the plum in this. Very nice and fruity. Love that. The so next thing. Okay, this new product is a bubble bar. And I was most excited for this because it's the same scent as one of my favourite bath bombs. Which is Sex Bomb. I love it. I love the jasmine and clary sage. This is actually, I think it's supposed to look like Santa, Santa's legs in the top of a sack. I don't even know, but the legs are actually bath oil. So you can have like two baths in one, or I've just chucked the whole thing in. And obviously got the bubble bar. It looks very like sort of tongue in cheek, funky and very, very festive. As you know, Clary Sage and Jasmine Ennis, and this one is called Kinky Boots. Yeah, <laughs> I didn't know what else to say about that. But I'm very, very excited to use that one. This one is a new one that has also become extremely popular very quickly. And it's Space Girl scented. I love Space Girl because it is a classic in the lush world and is I want a hippo for Christmas. A tiny little hippo with gold stars on the top which is so cute. Little I want a hippo has grapefruit, bergamot, almond scented oil and cold pressed raspberry seed oil. I love it. I love Space Girl. I love how fresh but also kind of fruity it smells at the same time and it's gonna make some really pretty purple bath water. Shoot for the stars! So if you're a big fan of Honey I Wish You Kids soap, shower gel, shampoo, anything that scent, you'll love this and it is redesigned this year so the cocoa butter stars are bigger so you get three in there and this one's my favourite like classic Lush Bath Bomb for like butters. It's just really hydrating in the water as well and I just love it. I love the design, like they always get the colour of this right. It's such a gorgeous blue and it's vegan, so even though it's supposed to smell like honey, you have bergamot oil, almond oil, there's also Brazilian orange oil and creamed coconut in there. So very, very comforting and would go well with an exclusive bubble bar I've got already stashed away. And that is the other way done. Oh! Oh! We have something else. What is this? It's the very body spray. We have 100 millilitres classic Snowberry body spray and it is so cute. I love it. So that is gonna help me keep my addiction going to the body spray until next payday when I will buy another one. So very happy. Right, straight away I see the other Wowbox exclusive, which is Celebrate Body Milk. 
so I think in previous years it has been bubbly shower gel in the scent form and this is almond oil, Brazilian orange oil, coconut oil, lime oil and paprika oleo resin probably pronounced that completely wrong and if you haven't guessed already is God of Wonder So nice. This is a body milk because it's supposed to be much lighter and more absorbent into the skin so it is obviously going to be easier to use than a body lotion. So I'm going to put the first body milk on my arm and put the other one on my other arm and let's just try it out on camera. So it's kind of like for me, it's like a sorbet kind of texture. That is so gorgeous. So nice and strong in scent as well. And such a nice sharp, zesty fragrance. And my skin feels immediately soft. And it's already gone in, which is amazing. And yeah, very happy with that. I'm looking for the other one to show you guys while I'm here. So the other one is a Yognob body milk, which you can actually buy in store as a Christmas product. So almond oil again, clove bud oil, lang lang, gardenia extract, and classic Yognog scent. Oh, so warming, spicy, and buttery. I just want to eat it. I love Yognog so much. I literally would inhale this all day. So we're gonna put a bit on here, there, and we're gonna apply it to the skin. Uh, oh my gosh, this feels so nice and light. Oh my god, I want to eat this, guys. So I've got very contrasting scents. Warm, spicy, buttery. Okay, my camera just stopped recording because this is the longest video I've probably filmed in forever. But as I was saying, sharp and zesty one arm, really nice and buttery on the other. Very, very happy with this year's selection of body milk. And so, from body milk, I can already see the free shower gels for this year. And I'm going to start with the new one, which I can see is bright orange, and it is roasting chestnuts on an open fire, which sounds very, very cosy and festive. And we have chestnut puree, almond essential oil, cassia oil, clary sage oil, cedarwood oil, and oat milk and fine sea salt. So let's give this a smell. Oh, this is very, very nutty. Oh, I got it in my nose. Kind of like marzipan, but very, very nutty. Instead of a bit sweet, if that makes sense. I love that. That's actually quite nice, actually. But this is got pseudo cocoa anthocytate, which is derived from coconut. So a lot of the new shower gels are now a bit more sort of jelly-fied and creamier. So that makes it a bit more softer and gentler on the skin, I feel like, personally. The other one, of course, is classic Snow Fairy, which I absolutely love. Of course, I'm just gonna give this another sniff because oh, it's so good, it's so good. What is much Christmas without Snow Fairy, guys? And the other one, which goes with Yogurt Body Milk, is of course Yogurt Shower Gel. This is super glittery. They haven't changed anything from last year except made it palm free. So. Yeah, don't know what else to say. You know how it smells from my reaction to the body milk. We still have some bubble bars to look at. So the first one is called Elfie Stick, which literally reminds me of Elf, the film. 
and that's kind of citrusy in a weird way. This is a reusable bubble bar, so you just hold it under the running tap and you get loads of bubbles. So it's got lab, lab dane and resinoid, sassina lemon oil, and vetivert oil. So definitely a bit more of a warm citrus smell. Like I absolutely love the detailing on this bubble bar. It's so cute and very, very festive. The other reusable bubble bar is returning this year and it is candy cane, which is super minty. Absolutely love it. And it's just a candy cane. So if you're familiar with that, you will love that. I see this year's a lip scrub, guys. Yay! So it's Candy Cane Lip Scrub. It's the same scent as the toothpaste jelly, which has been my favourite for like the past couple of years. And you have caster sugar and herbal oil as a base, shea butter, peppermint oil, and extra fine sea salt as ingredients. And I'm not going to try any because obviously I've got lipstick, but yeah very very traditional candy cane sweet scent and I'm sure it's gonna taste beautiful. I love lip scrubs because they're literally so natural and you can eat them and it makes your lips feel quite soft so you can like apply lip balm lipstick after. I don't really like the other flavours like bubble gum or honey or things like that. I'm more into my fresh mint smells. So my other favourite is mint juleps which tastes like after rates and this will be a perfect addition because it's more of a sweet uh, candy cane festive taste. So yay! I'm actually so happy about this one. Other ones I've got in shower. We have two new well, one new product and one returning favourite, of course, Snow Fairy Body Conditioner. Love it. It will go so well with my shower gel. And inside you have almond oil, cherry infusion, jojoba oil, avocado butter, mango butter, fruity organic cocoa butter and Persian lime oil. So it is a very conditioning as the name suggests and it is one of my favourite body conditioners to use because it is one of those few body conditioners that still holds like the actual scent, it doesn't change it too much so I find sometimes if you get a scent in body conditioner it doesn't smell the same as if you get it in the shower gel but Snow Fairy itself is basically pretty close and last year they had Yorgnog as a body conditioner but obviously it is a body milk now which is very nice and we have a new shower scrub and I'm very happy this is in a nice bigger pot because I do want to really enjoy this and it is orange shower scrub and you got sea salt, orange peel infusion, orange juice, red mandarin oil, tangerine oil, bergamot oil and orange peel wax which sounds amazing and so zesty and fruity and let's give it a smell oh my god how how that literally smells like terry's chocolate orange but without the chocolate element it does look very kind of like creamy in a weird way and not gonna lie i do love a shower scrub and Christmas to me is like Heroes from Cadbury and Terry's Chocolate Orange. This is going to be so good to have this slammed over me in the shower. <laughs> but yeah, I'm so happy about that. I think we're very nearly done. We've got two products left. If you're still watching this, you're doing great. <laughs> so the last one is in the bottles fairy dust dusting powder which obviously it comes out every year without fail sadly there's no massage bar this year which i don't know why but it just didn't come out but we have persian lime oil synthetic mask and cornstarch as the powder base yep so strong and gorgeous as snow fairy so I feel like if you do put too much body lotion on, if you're a bit oily, 
you can just pop this on on top or you can use it after your body conditioner so you're snow fairied out and the last product is my favorite shower bomb because it smells like baby powder which is very similar to jingle bells and inside this one is Hogwood cedarwood oil, cinnamon oil, almond essential oil and it is Rudolph nose oh, I just I can't get over how they do this scent I absolutely just freaking love it Stitching my favourite thing ever that is it is very very cute like Rudolph's nose and very glittery I don't know about the other two that I just unboxed but this one has a tendency to go very powdery and soft pretty really quickly and crumbly so I'm probably going to use this one first out of them because I do love it and I do want to enjoy it at its best so yes that is everything you get in the wild box and practically most of what you can buy for lush Christmas because this year's collection is definitely smaller especially with soap and bath so that is the box here can't wait to use this for storage love design and packaging if you have a Lushy in your life or you just love Lush so much yourself, I definitely recommend getting this because you do get a taste of everything. There is 32 products in this. As a recap, because this is one more, this is everything. So feel free to screenshot this if you want or literally just go to Lush.co.uk and yeah. Thank you so much for watching this year's Lush Christmas haul. I'm blurry on the camera, great. This is definitely different from previous years because I literally just buy the product separately, but this year I decided to go hard. So, things I want to buy next are golden pear, soap, and things like that. But obviously, I'm gonna make myself to wait till next payday. But have a lovely rest of your weekend. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and click the notification bell below to get updates when I next update a video. And comment below what your favourite product is from this year's Last Christmas collection. I would really love to know. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Goodbye!